Good morning. Happy Monday to you all. The Mystic Modeler Bruce from the garage here in beautiful Edgewater, Florida. There's not a cloud in the sky. It's just going to be a beautiful day. This is the final reveal of the Monkey Mobile. And I did not monkey around with this one. So this was a fun build. I had a lot of fun building this car. My wife likes this car. She likes all of them, but this one, she goes, you have nothing like this in your stash. So this is a really good one. So let me show you what's going on here. And uh, I'm going to bring this around and see if I can tilt it down a little bit and see if you can see it. Slide this up a ways. And there she is. The Monkey Mobile. Back in. Now, I didn't glue the top down, and I really didn't glue the body down yet. I don't even think I will. I think it's just fine the way it is. It snaps in there. It's a unique car. I like the color. Came out really nice. It finally dried that enamel. There's the front. You can see that. Pretty good, I'm sure. Side. Got a couple of coats of pledge on it. I like the parachute. I painted it this uh, AK NATO green. <laughs> I painted it NATO green instead of black like they always do. thought that was pretty cool. I put a license plate on it. I don't know if you can see it. It's California. It was left over from the ZZ Top build that I did. The hot rod. California plate. Um, I think it looks pretty good. Let me take the top off here. You can see going on in there. I detailed it out a little bit. I used that uh, on the gauges. I used the five minute epoxy, mixed the two together and uh, made it look like um, covers, black covers. So, here she is, the monkey mobile. This uh, color I used on the top and in the interior is, uh, to me, is uh, XF59 Desert Yellow. It came out really nice. Real nice. This I like putting on here, like so. I think that's pretty good. But that's a monkey mobile. Very unique. Very unique. So I think uh, my next build is going to be an airplane. I'm going to do that airline build. Um, get it ready for Max. Um, I need to switch off of cars a little bit and get to an airplane maybe. Or maybe a ship or a battleship or something. I don't know. But I think I'll do the an airplane. Um, it's a kit I have by Airfix. I can't remember the name. It's Indian Airways back when they... Uh, the Brits owned India, or had a colony there, or part of the empire, and they, it's, um, but that's it, that's about it. So let me know what you think, leave a comment down below please, and um, hey, hey, we're the monkeys. We're just monkeying around. I think the tires came out really nice with the Goodyear on them. It's for stickers I had left over. Uh, water on from uh, the uh, Tamiya Terrell P34. They had a bunch of extra ones in there, so I used them on there. But that's it. So let me come back to me. 
Yeah, the next build is going to be an airliner, I think. Uh, uh, four engine propeller biplane that they used in uh, Egypt or India, I should say. And uh, Indian Airways. Um, I'll start that. Put that together to paint. It's a different, totally different kind of build, so that'll be fun. And, um, you know, simple stuff. I like simple things. So, alrighty, guys, I'm going to let you go. You have a great day, and um, peace be with you. All you guys out there, hang in there. Thanks for the comments. Vince, thanks for, uh, thanks for the comments on enamel paint, too. Because I usually use acrylics. And, uh, yeah, humidity is a lot to do with acrylics, too. So, you know, that couple-day drying time when you spray Rust-Oleum enamel or any kind of enamel. So, we'll see. You know, I got uh, a 32 Ford uh, Woody to do. And I've got uh, the Little Red Wagon, which will be a, a challenge to get those doors to fix or whatever happens, happens. But uh, I'm looking forward to it. But this airline build, I think, is the one I'm going to go with. So, hang in there, guys. Uh, be hearing from you soon. I'm watching you. Um, and uh, have a great day. Have a great Monday. Because I'm going to. Till the next time, this is the Mystic Modeler. From the garage, Bruce, and oh Max, I've got that. I'm gonna. I don't know if to mail it or uh, I might text you today and see if you want to meet up and I can uh, I can give you that kit instead of putting it in the mail. So uh, you know, let me know. Uh, I'm gonna shoot you a text. So I'll talk to you guys later. Peace out.